Our Pothole Patrol has received nearly 1,500 submissions from you on our Newsnet 5 app. Some of those complaints coming from the city of Lakewood. That is where investigator Jonathan Walsh is tonight. And Jonathan, many roads there are ruined. Yeah, as a matter of fact, now we have some rough patches like this one here, Athens Road, and the city of Lakewood says it has pavement condition ratings, and despite all of this, Athens is not on the list, but city leaders tell us that they are trying to address other areas. A lot of people have had problems with the potholes. I talked to Michael Maloney along Woodward Avenue, a problem area you told me about. Michael hit a hole so hard with a previous car that... I lost my air suspension and I had to replace the tires. And from there, my car basically just bounced up and down. I followed up on your complaints along Athens Road, where huge chunks of asphalt are left behind. I saw rim rattlers along Donald near Clifton and a rocky road on Margaret. Mike Orsagas describes some of the roads. Have you ever been in a paint mixer in a hardware store? That's about what it feels like. Mike stood along Madison. That is getting redone this summer. Cost $2.4 million. Thanks to some outside funding, that's a bump up from the $1.5 million the city usually spends, explains Sean Juris, who chairs council's public works committee. Athens is pretty rough. Okay. Woodward is pretty rough. I showed Sean your complaints, and you told me Woodward is on the repaving list. He explained the city has gone through and raided its streets recently, whereas years ago that wasn't necessarily the case. The squeaky wheel got the oil, um, you know, so whoever complained the loudest got their street repaved. Um, and certainly that was not a, a way to go about uh, doing work. Michael told me he hopes the city has more work planned for problem potholes. You literally have craters that are sometimes like a foot deep, and that's just, that's too much, man. As I stand in this finger leg, Councilman Juris tells me that the city is constantly out with cold patch, will be out with hot patch too. And he also says the city isn't opposed to getting things uh, updated technology like dirt patch or possibly the pothole killer. Reporting live here in Lakewood, I'm investigator Jonathan Walsh, News Channel 5. And we want to know about the chuck holes that you deal with every day. Go to our app and tap Pothole Patrol. We'll ask local leaders what is being done to fix them.